The police patrolling this market have a specific task. They're looking for traffickers, but not just any traffickers. We're checking this market for the illegal trade of animals from the forest. In Brazil, wild animal trafficking continues to grow, with an estimated 250,000 animals captured and sold each year. These animals sell for 10 times less on the black market than via legal channels. Birds are the most sought after, with prices going from $10 for a common specimen to up to $9,000 for an ara parrot. The rarest animals command the highest prices. This man was arrested for trying to sell a parrot for a few dollars. The bird will now be transferred to a refuge for wild animals near Rio, where it will join other mistreated animals like this hedgehog, which arrived last week. It was hit on the head. Probably someone found it in their home and wanted to get rid of it. Or even someone who meant to kill it to later eat it. But the hedgehog managed to escape. Each year, an estimated 8,000 animals bound for the black market end up at this center, often in bad shape. Of those which are not rescued, some 40 percent end up in Europe or North America. Brazilians, not foreigners, are largely responsible for the trafficking. There's a great diversity of species in Brazil, and a lot of very beautiful animals which people want to have. It is a cultural custom for Brazilians to have all kinds of animals at home. Brazilian law only punishes traffickers with a fine if they promise to stop such activities. Thanks to such leniency, animal trafficking is now the third most lucrative illegal activity in Brazil after arms and drug trafficking. It is estimated to generate over $1 billion a year.